I'm Kat, and this tutorial is how to make this mystery braid wrap bracelet. It wraps twice around your wrist, and it's one solid piece of leather and secures with this little nub thing. I like this style because it's kind of a unisex bracelet, and um, it's pretty cool. For this project, you'll need a sturdy cutting surface, your leather, the thinner the better, a straight edge or ruler, a leather punch tool, these things that are called Chicago screws for some reason, and a really sharp knife to cut your leather. Begin by measuring your leather piece to make sure that it's long enough. You'll want it to wrap twice around your wrist and then overlap by about two inches or more. Next, mark the entire length of your leather one inch wide. After that, you're ready to cut it. Use your ruler or straight edge and be very careful that you don't cut yourself. Once you've cut your entire strip of leather, you'll want to cut two long slits starting about one inch from each end of your strip of leather. Make sure that you've cut them all the way through and then you're ready to begin your braid. Begin with right over center, then left over center, then right over center again, and then you'll want to take the bottom of your braid and put it through the hole on the right side of your bracelet. You'll get the hang of this as we go. Then continue left over center, right over center, left over center again, making sure that nothing gets flipped over in the process. Then take the bottom of your braid and pass it through the hole on the left side this time. Just like that. You'll see this straightens out what was twisted just a second ago. Now you're ready to continue. Right over center, left over center, right over center again. Then take the end of your braid and pass it through the hole on the right. Just like that. Continue left over center, right over center. And be careful that your strips of leather don't flip over. Then take it through the left side again. Then right over center, left over center, right over center again. Take the bottom of the braid through the right side. Left over center, right over center again, left over center, and then take the bottom through the left hole, right over center, left over center, right over center, then pass it through the hole on the right. You're always going to pass it through the hole of the same side that you started that braid on. So you're starting on the left this time, left over center, right over center. left over center, and because you started on the left, pass it through on the left. Now when you get to this point and it looks like it's going to get really hard to braid, you're done. You just need to tighten up this end that you're finishing on and loosen up the end that you started on. It's best to start your braid tighter than you're going to want it because that's going to make it easier for you to braid it as much as you want, and then you can just even everything out later on. And then check that it fits. Set your leather punch to a hole that's about as wide as the wide part of the finding and punch a hole in one end. Then you'll want to use a setting that's about as wide as the smaller part of your finding, punch a hole in the opposite end, and then slip the smaller part of the finding through and top it off with the wider part of the Chicago screw. Make sure it's good and tight and that's all ready. Then you'll want to take that wider hole that you punched and cut a slit down towards the rest of your bracelet out of that hole. That's going to make it easy to slide the Chicago screw through that, so it's easy to put on, but it's still not going to fall off. And that is your finished bracelet. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like, share, and subscribe.